If you're looking for a bare bones, super affordable bull bar for your 2007 and newer Tundra at home, then Rough Country's option here in black might just be the one for you. Now this extremely popular bull bar will combine a painted steel build with that popular three inch diameter, offer right around the low to mid $200 price point, making this, by the way, one of the most affordable in the category. But why go with a bull bar like the Rough Country here in the first place? Well, there will be some very minor protection benefits from smaller impacts both on and off road, but I would definitely not consider this a full blown piece of armor because it just simply will not be the case. Now, outside of that minor protection, a bull bar like this certainly helps deliver a very tough look that a lot of truck owners really dig, while also giving you some opportunities to mount some auxiliary lighting thanks to the pre-drilled holes that also includes some rubber plugs. Now, I will say that if you really have your heart set on adding auxiliary lighting at the same time or using a bull bar, well, there are some turnkey options here on the site that do incorporate either a 20 inch light bar and a bull bar together uh, for an affordable price point as well. So as always, feel free to check out the rest of our selection here at XT if you wanna see what else we're working with. But getting back to the Rough Country option here, and this is gonna feature a very traditional or basic design when it comes to the bull bar, and that is your single hoop here, as you can see. You got a crossbar, and then finally, the incorporated skid plate down below. Now, the entire bar has been built from that three-inch tubular steel and is finished off in a durable, I would say, satin black paint here. It's not quite gloss, not quite flat, and everything is backed by a five-year limited warranty in case you run into any issues. Now, I do wanna point out also that if you have a chrome package equipped Tundra at home, and maybe you prefer to match the bull bar to your chrome bumpers or whatever the case, you can find a few different chrome bull bars here on the site for a few bucks more if you're interested in that. But what do you say we switch gears and talk about the installation process? Now, site's gonna call this a solid one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter, maybe a couple of hours of your time to complete from start to finish, depending on how fast you like to work. But to give you a better idea of just how things will go down on your Tundra at home, here's an XT customer to walk you through the job now. Check it out. For installation of your Rough Country Bull Bar, you need a 19 millimeter and a 17 millimeter wrench then I also used a 17 millimeter and 19 millimeter socket wrench. All right, first thing we're going to do, we're going to undo both sides of the tow bar. There's the driver's side. Side. All right, next thing is you take the uh, brackets and you put them underneath the tow bar and you zip them up with the 17 millimeter. Once you get your brackets on, then you take a 19 millimeter wrench, tighten it up with somebody holding it for you. Is that good? All right, now I'm out the passenger side. Last thing is, is you snug up the bottom with a 17 millimeter socket. So wrapping things up here, guys, the Rough Country 3-inch bull bar will be a super affordable option to toughen up that front end of your Tundra at home, and you can find yours right here at ExtremeTerrain.com.